If you're like me who couldn't stand throwing away cotton rounds like the used toilet paper, consider this reusable facial round made in the States. It has so many patterns to choose from, but the smart choice would definitely go with the all white packs, so you know when it's time to change. So I've been using this since last June, and I only rotate 6 out of 20 pieces. I usually use it to wipe my face with some wild derma and wash it by hand to make it more durable. You can use some baking soda and soak them overnight to give you that clean darling teeth look until it's totally beaten up like this one. I've been using a handmade soap made with calendula. It's good, but I also spotted this famous brand on my trip in Kyoto. Please excuse the plastic package inside, but the sales lady claims the safflower oil moisturizes the skin and it heals acne scar, and it's made in Japan. What else can I ask for? You just pay a few dollars for a foaming net and switch it to a soap bar so you can avoid chemical foaming products in the market. I know hotel amenity is a real convenient, but when was the last time you actually reused that plastic toothbrush? It was a hello to my first sustainable humble. Just like the app Bumble, it looks as handsome as the Swedish dentist who designed this brand. And I know you make a free plastic toothbrush with the same price, but come on, it's biodegradable. Given the humid weather in Hong Kong, it does get moldy at the bottom, but you can just paint with some oil paint left from your high school, so problem solved. I tried the moon cup before, but in reality, I like to finish my business quick and painless. So I turn into this reusable menstrual pad. The black one is a bamboo charcoal fiber, and in my opinion, it's easier to wash off the stain than the white cotton. It's high absorbent, antibacterial, and sensitive skin friendly. Just wrap it up like so, and remember to wash it with cold water, and you're good to go. I have very high standard to a water bottle, and I think I find the right one. This one from Fing Sports comes with a small mouthpiece, so I won't wet myself easily while on the go. And it is insulated to keep my matcha latte hot and cold. Next time, just bring your own bottle and find a water fountain nearby you. I'd like to shout out to Eco Green Energy, a more affordable retailer in Hong Kong who sells this amazing straw bag. It has this easy zipper design and it's water resistant, so you don't have to worry about your bubble tea stain. It also fits my foldable cutlery for any takeaway or spontaneous painted beach moment. This grab and go container is unbeatable. It's light, durable to heat, and the design is unlimited. This one from WWF has this gorgeous Hong Kong eco map design, which is perfect for souvenirs. I personally recommend this one over the lavender cotton version for easy cleanliness and this is actually made with recycled plastic. How cool is that? This stash of bag really surprises me. It has all the goodness of a zip bag, minus the thin plastic bag of course, and it's made with pure platinum silicone. Just drop this baby into a body mortar for your sous vide lamb rack, or often cook your tasty Brussels sprouts. I'm kidding, I didn't do Brussels spouse, but you get the picture. Don't judge a book by its cover because this olive foil soap is so multifunctional. I bought it because I wanted a plastic free option for my dishwashing routine, and with only olive oil and mineral salts are used. It's great for dry skin, and you can use it as a makeup remover. Perfect for vegetarian or vegan beauty guru. I know, it's a plain mirror, but this baby has lasted me over 5 years and is still growing strong. It's a perfect example of how we sometimes take the smallest things for granted, so just go through your stuff and try to find a plastic-free alternative when it's no longer usable. Those who are into eco products must be familiarized with this eco bag. It comes with long and short handles, rainbow colors to match your outfit, but to be honest, it's more of an aesthetically pleasing product than a fungible one when it comes to grocery shopping. But at least you're spreading the message on going green with this natural material. For the grand finale, I would like to thank this simple mat I've been rocking since 2011. It's very stain forgiving and quick to dry. Just bring your loved one on a picnic date with a cute mat and you're guaranteed to have a good day. So that's all for my sustainable essentials. Just took a moment to try out this minimal lifestyle and I'm sure you will enjoy it too. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.